asada layer with rice, beans, and cheese, wrapped in several feet of tortillas. We take a bite of the anaconda burrito as Bailey's Bites goes on the road to Taqueria Urales in Fresno. Well, for weeks we've been hearing there's a burrito being made here in Fresno that's too big for any one man to eat, and I thought, let's check it out and see if it's as big as they say it is. So we're here in search of the anaconda burrito at Taqueria Urales. All right, well, we've made it over to the home of the Anaconda Burrito. Joining us right now is Edwin. Edwin, how's it going this morning? Pretty good, man. Real blessed to be here with you. All right, very cool. Well, tell us about Takadiri Urales. What are you guys known for here? We're known for the Anaconda Burrito. It being three feet and it feeding a whole family or one big person. Now, what kind of flavors can people expect when they come here and order food? What do you all serve up here? So we serve from burritos to tacos to asada fries, nachos, sopes. Uh, you know, the basic taqueria food. So I know that you guys are known for kind of your authentic flavors. What makes your food so authentic? Uh, what makes it authentic is that everything is cooked and made fresh, always. Every day we cook the meat fresh, every day we, co we cut the, the ingredients. All right, perfect. And so today we're going to get a chance to sample the anaconda burrito there. Sure. Yeah. All right, it sounds good. Of course, the food here we've heard is amazing. Let's head off to the kitchen to check it out. the moment we've all been waiting for the anaconda burrito laid out here at Wint. I got to tell you, man, this thing is massive. Tell us what's inside of it. Yeah, yeah. So uh, the ingredients is rice, the beans, the cilantro, the tomato, and the onion. Sour okay. cream, cheese, uh, guacamole, red and green hot sauce, and a couple pounds of, of meat. <laughs> a couple of pounds of yep. meat. Did you hear that? Yeah. You wonder why we have to stay in the gym. You got to love it. But we hear this is delicious. Talk to us about the flavors we should expect biting into this. You get a lot of flavor, man. Juicy meat, oh. uh, flavorful beans. You see it well seasoned, the rice, homemade, everyday, fresh. So you can imagine what flavor you can get. You don't have to tell me twice, man. I've got to take a, 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 of course, a little taste test here going on. So we've cut a little piece of it. I've got pretty big hands, and this is a pretty big burrito. Oh my God, take a look at that. Mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now I see why they say one guy can't finish this burrito. It's definitely lived up to what I thought it was going to be. Oh my God. How'd you come up with the idea for the anaconda? So it was idea after idea. You know, we we're trying to make a big quesadilla at first, a big party tray of nachos. You know, until we hit the jackpot, and we ended up hitting the jackpot with this big bad boy right here. It's been good ever since. Oh my gosh. Well, I want to thank you for taking some time to let us come by. To see more great food that the Central Valley has to offer, head over to yourcentralvalley.com.